Come closer and focus for 10 seconds. Which clip looks cooler? Clip one or clip two? It's Template Thursday fam, and here's the saucy situation. Let's say you're showing off a person or a company's IG page in a video, and you want to show off your editing skills and give your client the visual boost that they need on their IG account. Let's say your clients are a fashion brand trying to sell clothes, or a rodeo trying to get people to give them a follow in order to promote their future events. Maybe your client's a musician promoting their personal artist page. Every other video editor that your client has hired does this when their IG page is mentioned in a video. But you do this. And the secret is you can actually do this in only five minutes with this special trick that I'm about to show you. But your client doesn't know that, so you can still charge them a normal premium rate. Two steps, that's all it takes. First, go into Photoshop beta, and it's gotta be Photoshop beta, not the regular Photoshop, and then bring in your photo. Duplicate your image by right-clicking and pressing duplicate. Now click on the top photo and blind the bottom photo. Click on the object selection tool and then click on the man, then hold down shift and click on the trumpet. You should now have both the man and the trumpet selected. Now hold down control shift I to get the inverse selection and press delete to delete the background behind the man and the trumpet. Now blind the top photo. Now unblind the bottom photo and click on it. I use the pen tool to draw around both the man and the trumpet. Now use generative fill to try to remove them from the foreground. Now type remove and generative fill to again tell it to remove the man and the trumpet. Now the template that we're looking at today is called the 3D Photo Pop-Up Pack. Many of you have already taken advantage of our $9 Envato Elements deal in the first link below to get this pack at no extra charge, along with everything else on Envato Elements. But if you haven't already done this, signing up takes like 30 seconds. So. Now that you've done all this, go over to the second link in the description and then download the 3D Photo pop-up pack. Now open up the After Effects file that's contained inside. Now open up Scene 1. Now import the Photoshop PST that you just made as a composition. Find the folder with both the background and the foreground layers of your PSD here in this folder that was automatically created. Now place the background layer in the Scene 1 background After Effects comp and place the foreground layer in the scene one foreground after fix comp. Now go to scene one main comp and check out the result. Impress your clients guys and lock them in.